let's get this started. Oh, it's a bit loud. Oh, I just turned off everything. There we go. I am very excited to play this game right now. On stream, at least. Uh, I played a little bit of the game. I actually got to Chapter 2, and I completely... Uh, I just never had time because of all the other games that I was playing. But, I'm actually excited to get back into it. Um, I did put the, my initial save on hard. It, it It's frustrating. Mostly because, yeah, it, they do a lot more damage. But, yeah, uh, I'll do that whenever I get my sea legs with these games. Because I probably shouldn't have used put it on hard. So I can be able to enjoy the game more. Mostly because, I mean... I'm not too big into... I don't play a lot of these type of video games, so... Where are they? Tactical strategy? Yeah. <coughs> but... <coughs> welcome everyone, welcome. I am, of course... Jack. Co-host of the Hack Jack Show. For those of you that are new... Uh, I do hope to see most uh, more of you in the future. I am getting close to my affiliate goal on Twitch. I saw that there is a, quite a few people that followed me uh, offline, and I am just excited to see if I can get to affiliate. <coughs> Sorry. But yeah, very excited to see what's going to happen from there. I'm going to wait a little bit just in case to see if more people come in. But... Uh, yeah, I mean, how's everyone's day been going? I'm so glad that I finally beat a uh, Alien Isolation. I did not expect to do that last night, and I hope to uh, I hope to God I didn't accidentally woke up my my brother because there were a few startles here and there, and of course having headphones on. I really can't tell how loud I was, but that's not gonna happen here. No scares, no scares in here. So I'm really hoping to have like a very relaxing night. We got my soda, some water, a bunch of water, and chewing on ice. But let's get this started. I want to get through this. I want to see what's up. See what's in, uh, in the up and up. On the faraway continent of Norzelia, Let me double check the volume to see how loud it is. Rained. Okay. Seems like it's good. I think. The kingdom of Glenbrook, through which runs the mighty Norzelia River, bringing flourishing trade. Yeah, it seems like it's good. Okay. The Grand Duchy of Esfrost. A land of ice and snow beneath which slumbers rich veins of iron. And in the desert, the holy state of Hyzat, home to the lake from which is harvested the salt, is central to life. With each nation controlling one vital resource, conflict between these three powers was all too common. Minor disputes and skirmishes gave rise to fierce battles. Aw, oh, man. You can't actually hear both. The realm was engulfed in a bloody conflict that would rage I'm trying to make sure years. that you don't hear double. Many died in what came to be known as the Salt Iron War. Brought to their limits and facing their mutual demise, the three powers at last negotiated a truce. You're saying? The Norzelia Consortium is formed. A neutral oh. organization that oversees fair trade of iron and salt. Sorry, that was my brother. He was helping me out with the audio. It sucks. I guess I have to find a way to figure out how to listen through, but oh, I can do Bluetooth. Oh, but I can't do Bluetooth, because if I do Bluetooth, then you guys can't hear. That's a sucky thing. I remember I tried that before. It didn't work out too well. Oh, well, I just, I'll just listen, I'll just read. Everyone else can enjoy the, the voiceovers. Reading didn't kill me. 
Didn't kill me in high school, that's for sure. I gotta say, it looks a lot better whenever I have it on my monitor. Instead of seeing this all in the tiny uh, LCD screen. Congratulations, my lord. The future of Wolford is looking brighter than ever. Ah, yes, congratulations. I didn't even do anything yet, did I? Today's the day, is it not? We're all ready for the big moment. What big moment? I forgot. Well, what's happening? Thank you, everyone. Young Master, Lord Saranoa. Now, what kind of name is Saranoa? So, you were here after all. Ah, Benedict. It would seem word has reached the people already. You can thank Eridor for that. Oh, there's the auto button. He couldn't refrain from... Oh. This is a momentous day. That's not, not the button. for our domain, but for all of Glenbrook. There's the button. There's the auto button. There we go. To keep it a secret. This is well and true, my lord. But you must consider your betrothed's lineage. Oh yeah, I'm getting I'm married. Well aware of the situation, I forgot about that. I cannot say for sure what repercussions this may oh. have. What I do know is that the people Unintentional dogs. For us and harbor hope for the future. As the future lord of House Woolfort, I must rise How to the How dare occasion. Hack start playing a video game? Fine resolve, my lord. You should be supporting me. Steward, I will do all in my power in my, to in my time of strife. Thank you, Benedict. It is heartening to have the support of my father's right-hand man. You know, I noticed that his name is Benedict. We head to the port and I hope it's not going to be some kind of play on word with, like, I Benedict Arnold. More time. Where he's going to end up, like, the river's betraying us in the end. With the heavy rain Again, only got to chapter two, so I don't know. And given the wind, I think it but at the same time, the more I look at him, the more I think he can betray us. Never cease to amaze. Very well then. Let us be on our way. Actually, I could do Bluetooth. I'm gonna try that next time. I'm gonna put up another. I'm a not stream, but I'm gonna. I'm gonna see if that that works because I did Bluetooth through the Nintendo Switch, but not through the speaker. If I can do that, I'll be listening to one ear the game, and then the other ear is gonna be on the the chat. All right, so let's see, world map selecting events, we'll advance the story. There are two types of events, main and sub. Main events are crucial to the flat, while subs are entirely optional. Gotcha. But will disappear from the map as the story progresses. All right. I'll keep note of that. Roster, inventory, war chronicle, and system has been added to the main menu. Pressing X to open the main menu, which is such a weird thing. This game uses autosave, however, there is only one autosave. Uh, X. System, I'll save. Eh, I'll keep my other saves. Yeah, I'll just keep my other saves. There we go. I tried hard. I couldn't do it that well. Don't judge me. I guess I'm not too strategic. At least not yet. Oh, fun thing. I actually did add the lurk command. So if you do the lurk command, if anyone's there doing the lurk command, I want to see how it works. Hopefully I did it right. He will be along shortly, no doubt. If I have heard true, he is not the type to keep a lady waiting. By your leave, then. We wish you everlasting happiness, my lady. Thank you. I shall work hard, both for my new home and for my motherland. Please let brother, the Archduke, know that. Don't forget to follow somebody and subscribe for me. more of me, because I am and the best girl. <laughs> Ah, uh, I forgot that the the art the random text to speech will go first every single time when someone talks. I don't know why. 
I'm not lazy, just efficient. Yeah, I don't know why you got why you girls do that. You always want to say your your random text first before you want to do anything else. But yeah, it seems like the lurk command is working properly. Because if you do it, it it's not gonna have like if you do it now, it's not gonna have it do that weird mess. But it seems like Nightbot's doing its thing. So good job, Nightbot. I much prefer it to being late. This is a momentous I'm probably going to have to ask some people on the, the Bikubot forum to see how I can be able to not let uh, the random text to speech chat a speech chat be crazy on me. It sure is working well. After all, this may be the last time in a while that I am free to do as I please. Most are not inclined to grant liberty to one of Roselle inheritance. Oh, and does it work if I do it? Let's see. I'm gonna try it out. You brought that pendant with you? I got this feeling somebody is watching me. And I got no privacy. <laughs> it's working perfectly fine. <laughs> oh, I love it. Nightball will be pretty static, but I, I, I like the randomness of having the girl say something. I got this feeling somebody's watching me. I got no privacy. The winds of fortune are blowing today, aren't they, Pa? Oh, I hate that little run. Brigands! Stand back, Frederica. In the I air do wells. All of them. How can you get one shot by these bandits? Y'all suck. These are crappy guards. A lot of them. To war we go. Alright, so if I'm correct, there is like a 2.5D aspect to this. What do you intend to do with us? So Make your little hostages, So it's best to look over the whole area Every to see how well you can traverse. What's with that pink hair though? Ya Rosellen? And that looks oh, yeah, like forgot. Being an anime Maybe protag in this bone. game is uh Apparently a minority. Impossible. You can't have Every pink hair. Enough. I am without a doubt. <laughs> Does not say anything. No shame. Attacking two innocent women? Says nothing. Stab just, person. Who, the hell are you? who am I? Who am I? Ah yes, conviction. Very much just a, it's just a fancy way of saying, your words influence how you sound. Who am I? You don't need to know. Surrender now. Uh, or who are you exactly? Two bears. Nah, you don't need to know. You don't need to know who I am. You need to know who. Surrender now, and we can resolve this peacefully. Yeah. Although that one guy I stabbed. Oh well, he had it coming. We don't do anything peacefully. Got that right. But if you surrender now, we'll spare your miserable lives. <laughs> Everyone just does not care about that one bandit I shanked. Indeed. They don't strike me as the type to be swayed by logic. Yeah, they're Quit very illogical. Just accept you're done for. Once Travis, his daughter Trish, and their mighty crew set their sights on you, <laughs> ain't nothing you can do. I don't know why Travis gives me Zap Brannigan vibes. I don't know if you remember Zap Brannigan. It's that one guy, that one space commander in Futurama. He's like, uh, oh man, 
Yeah, he just gives me zap frantic advice. He just like sends people out and then hopefully you you drop dead before he comes out to fight. My lady. I am a teacher of the arcane arts, and Frederica is a most apt pupil. Yeah, apparently you're both good at being mages, but you only taught her healing spells instead of anything like fire spells. Which would have been nice. Oh wait, no, she does know fire. I would have joined you sooner. I think she does. What are you doing here? Let us talk later. Now, I believe we have some lawless ruffians to rouse. Okay. So here's what I'm gonna do. Uh, Benedict's aptitude in fight and battle. He's a support character. He likes to buff people. Gotcha. Uh, Pyromancer is Frederica. Okay, gotcha. And Gila? Yeah, Gila is the, the healer of the group. Okay, gotcha. I had it all backwards. You know, as much as I love this company for how beautiful their art is, because they're the ones that made Triangle Strategy, uh, Bravely Default, and Octopath Traveler. And, of course, now, in the future, Octopath Traveler 2. But, my God, do I hate the way they name their titles. I mean, it gets the job done. It's simple. It's like Triangle Strategy. Okay, you got a triangle of, like, different strategies to do. Bravely default. There's a. There's a apparently a mechanic that's called bravely or something like that. And of course, Octopath Traveler. There's eight of them, and you're traveling together. Great titles. All right, battle positions. This reminds me a lot, a lot like Final Fantasy Tactics. So if you are familiar with it then you have pretty much, you pretty much already know what's going to happen, like how this works. Look at this dude, wasted a freaking... This guy wasted a turn, did nothing whatsoever. Uh, blue panels within moving range, purple panels within enemies range, red panels indicate that you can attack a unit. Gotcha. Uh, red panels indicate your attack range. Yellow indicates area of effect. Okay. We do not take kindly to thievery here in Wolford. You will pay for your crimes. For the honor yeah, that's right. Wolford. You'll pay for your crimes. Hmm. I don't know how far these guys go. Wait, I could simulate something. I didn't know I could simulate. Oh my god, if I knew I could simulate things, it would have been easier. There's commands, actions, we're just doing the... Okay, then items, gotcha. I didn't know I could simulate things. Uh, I kind of just want to... Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to keep... You know what? I'm gonna keep him here. I'm gonna end my turn here. Of course, facing them. You think you're all high and mighty, huh? <laughs> yeah, shut up. We're just trying to make a living here. We'll make a living somewhere else. So in this game, um, unlike Fire Emblem, which if you played Fire Emblem, if your characters get knocked down, they don't die or at least like how in some fire emblem games they don't die they just uh they just end up not being able to get any of the points like any experience let's see all for victory there we go we gotta give you some boost our victory is assured and then i guess i end my turn here my turn. what i want to do is i really really I'm gonna move here. I'm gonna force him to come to me. Because you know, having the high ground is the best ground. Shall we make 
in a contest, my friend? I think not. Whatever would I tell your father if harm were to befall you? These are no ordinary men. There he goes. There they go. Let us remain calm and clear headed. Cool heads shall prevail. Okay. Your wound. I don't think they have mm, MP, so I really don't need to. We must defend ourselves from this danger that threatens us. Okay. Let me show you what I've learned. So let's see. The problem is they can go behind me, I think. But like command, can I scorch him? Ah, yes, I can. With the powers in me. Take that. For the honor of House Wolford. Okay, let's see. So there's either delaying strike, which stuns them and push them back. Now nah, I'm just gonna do a regular strike. Oh, I, I missed. My turn. Out of all the times I missed there. My turn. Okay, you want to attack, but uh, you know what? I think now it's a good time to just come down. I'm gonna come down like one step. There is no mercy on the battlefield. It is time to strike. Giving her a magic attack boost because I need that. So in this game, you do have back strikes. So it's kind of, it's pretty dangerous to get hit by a back strike. That's right. What are you going to do about that? You fool. Shall we begin? Your wounds are healed. You should have went for the healer. Eyes are turning. I'm going to look this way, as always. For the honor of House Wolford. This ends here. And then, of course, look forward. <laughs> Charge. And let's just go ahead and... Ooh, wait, no. Double Thrust does more damage, though. No, never mind. It doesn't. It's over. I have the high ground. I see a path to victory. Ah yes, my cane sword. Man, it seems like you're all in perfectly good uh Let me show you what I've learned. Let's see. Oh, I can't use it again. Oh wait, hold on, hold on. I gotta look around here. Uh, I don't think they can come next to me, so... Ah, oh, but I can't do anything there. Oh, and he's gonna get backstabbed. And poor main character. He is getting demolished. On your guard. Coming through. Yeah, but you can't do anything. I won't lose. Mm, 
There we go. You don't stand a chance. Right in the back. There is no mercy on the battlefield. All for victory. Our victory is assured. You can't beat me. I'm a tactical. I'm a tactical man. Oh, let's see. With the powers in me. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Get wrecked. They drop something. Let's see. Cannot be used the moment they are acquired. You must emerge victorious to see the spoils you obtained. Okay. Gotcha. Point me at him. That's not really helping you much. Heal your wounds. Oh, but no, he does need to be up up. I don't actually no, I don't know. Be at ease. The tides are turning. I forget, the more hot the higher they are, the more uh mm, you know what? Let me just I'ma have him move this way. Wait, how much do I do in damage for this character here? You know what? I'ma just kill it. Perish. My turn. Yeah, that's right. What to do now? You don't stand a chance. Ooh. You see that? Did a critical. No mercy on the battlefield. Oh, can I attack from here? I don't think I can. See, what I'm just going to do, I'm just going to whack him with a stick. There we go. Just get whacked with a stick. Allow me. What? He still lives with one health. Oh. Shall we begin? So disappointing. This will help. Oh. My lord. Yeah. Ah, you're fine. <laughs> you're all fine. Perfect opportunity. No. Bullseye. For the honor of House Wolford. There we go. No, I'm, I just want to move here. Oh yeah, I can't move and attack. I forgot. Ouch. You're gone. Hmm. I mean, it's he's still gonna attack me either way, so I guess I just use a, a pellet. I'll try this. I kinda wanna keep his experience. That's the only reason why I'm here. There is no mercy. Your defense is weak. Allow me. Please heed my call. This Play man's about to be wailed face. on. He doesn't know it yet. My utmost thanks. Point me at him. Yeah, that's right. Keep running. No, I'm gonna push you back. I'll make this quick. Yeah, you're gonna wait your turn, my friend. For victory. Let's use another one just in case, because I'm I feel like I'm gonna get attack attacked by twice by two of them. Ugh, sorry. I see a path to victory. 
I have your back. It would be nice if this guy can do another move other than buff. My knowledge grows deeper. Oh, at least he leveled up. That's good. I fight for peace. <laughs> Did you just carry me? This man literally just carried me up. Yeah, that's right. My growth is plain to see. I'm bullying you. That's what you're gonna do about it. Defeat is not an option. Wait your turn. This is good. To lead, I must grow. My turn. And I might double thrust on you. My lance strikes true. There we go. I shirk from no danger. I shall try my level best. Taste my cane. Taste my old man fury. Really? I literally. Oh, okay, never mind. For a better world. There we go. Let me heal your wounds. Let me see who needs the heal. And we're fine. We'll just smack him. You have left yourself open. I've gotta get the upper hand. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. You can't just war. toss me into the river. This ends here. You've made Too late. You don't get the upper hand. Yeah, that's right. Get wrecked. Ready for battle. Yeah. Uh. I won't lose. You left your back open. You fool. You little. Did you see that? Let us cry out their weakness. I'm gonna box you in. Just because you did that. What have we here? Did you see that? Let me show you what I've learned. See, this is what happens when you don't think about what you're doing. Let me heal your wounds. Uh, I'll just heal. Your wounds are healed. You have my gratitude. Where shall we strike? Oh, oh, nope, nope. Right there. You'll rue this day, you bastard. Eh, I don't think so. Man, this is a lot easier on norm on normal. On hard, like at least two of my characters died. It was horrendous. I lost like uh, so much potential experience from them. It was saddening. Well, you've been defeated. Now what? Wait, I know that face. That's the Wolfort Lordling. Yeah, you better know my face. What's that you say? Wolfort? It can't be. Yeah, I'm your husband. What are they doing here so damn soon? This ain't I mean, I'm here to pick up my wife. That's what I'm here for. For a bunch of no good thieves. At least they know when they're in over their heads. Yeah, at least they know how to run. Time what happened to your horse? To apprehend them and see them atone for their crimes, but uh, so, so be it. it. Your bride to be is safe. Isn't that what matters? Yes, exactly. That is what it matters. My bride to be. Yes. My sincerest apologies. I had no idea we were being trailed by bandits. You weren't Where being trailed. They were literally just waiting for you at the dock. The they the they wait for anyone at the I dock that looks rich. I am honored to join you in marriage and to call House Walfort my new home. 
The honor and pleasure is mine, Lady Frederica. Pray forgive me for not introducing myself sooner. <laughs> to think you'd fight at each other's side in battle before exchanging your vows. That, you know, that is kind of romantic. Though, I dare say that being in a giant war, before being in a battlefield before even uh, getting married. <laughs> Your Highness! Here, here you are. Here I am. Why the entire Kingsguard has been scouring the land for you. Why? Did you sneak out of the castle again, Roland? Oh, that's what he did? When I heard my best friend's betrothed was arriving in Glenbrook, I simply couldn't miss the occasion. Well, were you trying to steal her away from me? I appreciate the sense. The Mr. Steal Your Girl on that one? You should have said something to the king. I'm the least of my dear father's concerns. Though I suspect Huet will think otherwise. I suppose I'd best be on my way back. What kind of name is Huet? Rest easy, my fair lady Frederica. You are in good hands here. I look forward to celebrating your union. Till we meet again. Oh, nice. Was that something of importance in the ring? Was it the one ring to rule them all? Oh. Could that have been? Prince Roland, King Regna's younger son. So a lord and a prince drove off a band of brigands by their own hand. What a fascinating nation we'd come to, Frederica. See, we we don't care about our status. We go ahead and fight the wars ourselves. You know what they say. If you want something done right, you gotta do it yourself. It was an honor to be able to witness it firsthand. Ain't afraid to get our hands dirty. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Sarah Noah of House Wolfort. And this is Benedict, trusted steward of my family. I still have kind of some uh to serve Lord Serenoa in any some suspicions of Benedict. Just because of his name. Of really, that's Lord, literally the only reason. I mean, you don't see too many games name their characters Benedict, so that just instantly goes to Benedict Arnold and a traitor. If it is not too far to say, I'm, I find it most beautiful. Find your courage mo more noteworthy than your appearance. Uh, log. Where's the log button? There. What? Oh, what does the the color of my hair mean to you? Uh. Hmm. You may think this is an odd okay. question, my lord. I'm trying to get away. There we go. Hmm. There. I'm just gonna go with most beautiful. I don't care. I don't care about. The, I I like it, the hair color. It is I like it. Forward of me to say so. I find it most beautiful. I thank you, my lord. But you need not flatter me. I will flatter you. I said only what I mean. I have always been fond of roses, and your hair is as beautiful Ooh, that as that's any of smooth. Them. I'm I'm gonna use that one day. I adore them too. See? Ooh, that is very smooth. Sarah Noah, damn. Lady Frederica, everyone awaits. Allow us to escort you back to Castle Wolfort. Thank you, Benedict. It would be my honor. Imagine being prejudiced of someone's hair color. Couldn't be me. Such a dumb thing to be to be like prejudiced about Sarah Noah of Glenbrook's house Wolfford. See they look like and a Frederica great couple. Esfrost look at them. Unite in marriage to strengthen the ties between their two nations. In doing so, 
the newfound allies hope to hold their own in the face of Hyzant's salt monopoly, which continues even now. So I think for tonight, I'm gonna keep the uh, I'm gonna keep it short this stream, mostly because since last night I was going on for such a long time, and I just want to have let my brother have a good sleep. Sure, he might say that it doesn't bother him. Like, he doesn't wake up from it, but still. I'd rather not be yelling in the middle of the night. So, with that being said, I think I'm going to have, like, the some of the Switch games move over to the evening somehow. Uh, Welcome back. The I mean, it's not going to be called Switch night because it's not going to be nighttime, but it's just going to be easier that way. While we were out. Just that Fridays will always be Switch night, so whatever I'm going to be playing on Friday is always going to be a Switch game. That's the rule for the Switch night. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Shake's fist. <laughs> Why, you little? <laughs> so yeah, to be more mindful of my brother. Because I know last night I did unintentionally yell because of the uh the scares that I had on on alien isolation lower your voice must you always shout so or can't you see that it was that big mouth of yours that invited trouble in the first place god damn there is no cause for concern Eridor. besides i'm not a child anymore mayhap not my lord but I've known you since you were knee high to a. Uh, never you mind. So, depending on how long uh, chapter one is, I think I'll end it on chapter one. And this must be the because I don't remember how long chapter one is. I am Frederica. It is a pleasure and honor to meet you all. And I am I just know it should be under two hours. Allow me to introduce those in service of House Wolfort. Oh yeah, I forgot. This is Arador, Master at Arms. I forgot. I, I can do this. Military forces. So, this is Benedict Pascal, the steward of the House Wolfort since the Saltarian War. He is he has the absolute trust of his liege and has overcome countless difficulties with his intelligence and level-headed judgment. So, I'm going to be doing that for all of them since we haven't really You'll be the lady of House Wolfort. Showed who they are, just their names. Alright, Eridor Bellantine. As an experienced soldier and commander of Wolfort's forces, he has served Simon alongside Benedict since the Saltarian War and continues to do whatever he can as a loyal retainer to the House Wolfort. And this is Anna, my right hand. All right, Anna. I don't really remember you. Anna Pascal. Oh, that's the si no, not sister. The probably daughter. An expert spy and Benedict's right hand. She has taken in by Wolfort after losing her parents and swears to do everything in her power to repay that debt. Okay, so she's a she was an orphan, adopted. Gotcha. They may not be of my blood, but they are my family just the same. And from this and. Day on, they're your family as well. Of course. This is Sarah Noah, the main protag. Sarah Noah Wolfort, the only son of Simon, a legendary warrior and head of House Wolfort. I am aware that in all of Glenbrook, House Wolfort is second only to the royal family in power and influence. I will do my best not to disappoint you. Alright. Frederica Asfrost. As? As? Ace? Frost? The eldest daughter of the Asfrost family and Sarah Noah's betrothed. She is the daughter of the former Archduke and Rosellan woman. And a Rosellan woman. A half-sister of Gustavo. 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 And here's Gila. Gila Breeze. Frederica's attendant and tutor in the arcane arts. She is once studied at the, at the Ministry of Medicine in ha Hyzant, but the allure of the Asfrost archives compelled her to move to the duchy. 
So those are the characters right now we have. Sorry, my lady, but you'll have to get used to it. <laughs> Funny. I'm not lazy, just efficient. Yes, you are, Alex. Remember, I must stay and discuss efficiency is clever laziness. So, yeah, you you actually kind of are lazy. Just efficient, though. You're efficient. Lady Frederica, pray come with me. Father is expecting us. Anna's aptitude in battle. Ah, yes, yeah, she's like a, a either a thief or a ninja, something like that. Strikes enemies from the shadow. Takes two actions in the same turn, and can conceal herself from the enemy's eyes. Cool. Eridor's aptitude in battle. Shields allies with superb defense. Ah, okay, so he's a tank. Gotcha. As you are well aware, there are two events of utmost importance to be conducted before Lord Serenella and his bride are wed. The ceremony to commemorate the joint mining venture. Still can't believe I'll be seeing the day when we break ground on a new mine right here in Glenbrook. And with the full support of Esfrost and Hyzant, no less. You can thank King Regna for I said Asfrost. Asfrost. God dang it. See, this is why I can't hear that well. I need to put on the, the Bluetooth mode. I'm gonna have to try that out today, or tonight, after the stream. From the Grand Duchy of Esfrost, Lord Dragan Esfrost, who is overseeing the technical side of the mining operation. No, he said Asfrost. The right. Holy State of Hyzant will be represented by Minister Lila Viscraft of the Saintly Seven. And our own Lord Simon will serve as Glenbrook's delegate and meet with the two before the ceremony. Yes? Quite so. After that, it will be House Wolfort's responsibility to see that our honored guests feel welcome. Anna, I would trust you safeguarding both Lord Dragan and Minister Lila. Consider it done. Then once that stuffy ceremony is over, we can get to the real highlight of the day. The tourney! Ah, my blood's already rushing. Just, just envisioning the greatest warriors from all the realm clashing swords. From Esfrost, Man, imagine having the original Final Fantasy games like this. Hyzant, like, it looks so beautiful. Marshall. I, have heard much I would love to have, like, the original Final Fantasy, like, the GBA Final Fantasies recreated like this. It would look so nice. And, of course, updated music. On that matter, there are two things I should make clear. Prince Roland has expressed a desire to join the tourney as a member of House Wolfort's contingent. Why would the boy want to fight with us and not his own arms master? Apparently, he originally formally requested to do just that, but King Regna would not allow it. Mm. And so he came to the young lord in hopes of finding another way in. Well, he's more than welcome in my book. The royal family said we're free to put together our own contingent, after all. I reckon His Majesty would be beside himself with joy if we could deliver a beaten to Esfrost and Isaac. Doubtless so. Very well. I shall inform the Prince that he is welcome in our ranks. Finally, there is the matter of Lord Simon's health? Indeed. Sadly, the Lord of the House is in no condition to participate in the tourney. Barring some miracle, I anticipate that Lord Saranoa will have to fight in his Lord Father's stead. Lord Simon. I suppose age takes its toll on even the mightiest of men. So be it then. Can leave watching over the young lord and Prince Roland to me. Good. I remind you that 
while this is a joyous occasion. Don't forget to follow right, and subscribe for more of me, because I am the best girl. Let us not yes, you are, Millie. Opportunity to catch us unaware. All right. Let me zoom out a little bit to see how far we are. Is there any extra stuff? Yeah, no, nah, not tonight. Or not right now. So let me first save. Yeah, it's a normal save, so I'm going to just override it. Can I actually look at my encampment? Oh, roster. Ooh, everyone got to level two. Nice. Very nice. Father, I bring to you my betrothed, the lady. Oh, I, I skipped there a little too early. I am Frederica of House Esfrost. Esfrost. Ho ho, the pleasure is all mine. All right, who is this? Simon Wolfort, legendary warrior whose valor brought an end to the Celtian War. Head of one of the three high houses of Glenbrook, he is an exemplary, exemplary, exemplary. Lord, who has the love of his people and the king's trust. Were it not for the efforts of House Wolfort, the Saltiron War would rage on oh, still today. Ah, Saltiron. I do My not bad. deserve the honor of joining your esteemed family, but I will endeavor to serve you all the same. Can't expect me to learn all these weird <laughs> no names in the matter of one day. You are tired from your journey, I am sure. Pray rest easy tonight. Thank you, my lord. I believe that in any journey, the first step is the most important. Before we go forward together, I should like to know why you chose to welcome one of Roselle in blood, such as I. Oh, oh, oh. I'd heard you were a strong-willed one. Pray forgive my insolence. Uh, and yet, I am set to marry into a mighty house of a foreign nation. I should like to know what you wish of me, that I might live up to your expectations. A most reasonable request. Both of you, listen well. Yes, Father. Your marriage was agreed upon by Glenbrook and S. Frost, that the ties between our two nations might be strengthened. To give us more leverage against Tizen, with their monopoly over salt. Precisely. With Glenbrook and S. Frost consolidating their power, Tizen was left with little choice but to join the Alliance. And yet, while Lady Frederica is indeed the Archduke's sister, at the same time she is the daughter of a Rosellan concubine. And House Wolfort, for all our military prowess, is no more than a bannerman of the king. If the aim was to forge the strongest bond we could between our two nations, it would be far more appropriate for my sister, Lady Erica, to wed the Crown Prince of Glenbrook. Just so, yet neither nation chose that. And do you know why? So that if relations between our two countries were to take a turn for the worse... We could be cast away like pawns. Precisely. Such are the schemes of those who rule nations. Oh, that's... that's sad. <sighs> I understand now. And yet, no matter how impure the intentions behind this arrangement may be, I will not bring dishonor to the Wolfort name. Well said, my son. If that is your decision, then... Oh, 
father. Lord Simon. Oh, it's Simon, not I Simon. I am an old man, and my health is not what it once was. For this reason and more, I have made my decision. As of this day, I abdicate my position as Lord of House Wolford. You will serve in my stead from tomorrow forth, my son. But, Father, I am not ready to... My decision is not made lightly. You have already shown me, with your words and your deeds, that you are more than ready. Think always about what your subjects need from you. Weigh your choices carefully, then take action. Do so, and I have no doubt you will make a great lord. And trust in Benedict. He shall serve you as well as he did. Thank you, Father. I will spare no effort that one day I may be as beloved by our people as you. Lady Frederica, your fate is not a simple one. There are many who would try to use the both of you as pawns in their own schemes. Even so, I hope that you will be there to support my son oh. through it all. Man, that is a very, very long cutscene if it's making my 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 switch go to sleep. And the wish of a father. Of course, my lord. It was my intention from the moment I boarded the ship. I beg pardon, my lord, but Lord Dragan and Minister Lilac have arrived. Very well. Presiding over tonight's banquet will be my final duty as Lord of the House. Tomorrow's ceremony will mark the beginning of yours, my son. And after that will be your wedding. Rest well tonight, both of you, for busy days lie ahead. <laughs> A young hawk soars completed. Save game, yes, please. Thirty years after the salt iron raged across Norzelia. A vein of precious minerals was unearthed in the kingdom of Glenbrook. From east to west, joy swept the land. United at last in common cause, the kingdom of Glenbrook, the Grand Duchy of Esfrost, and the holy state of Hyzant endeavored to wrest this bounty from the earth, with each nation providing expertise and resources. This uneasy alliance between once bitter enemies will herald a new era of tranquility in this long and battled realm. One after another, dignitaries from each nation arrive in Glenbrook to solidify this accord and toast to its success, the first step on the road to peace. Among those who would forge this road is Sarah Noah Wolfford. Inheriting the title of Lord Wolfford from his father Simon, he must decide what foundation he would lay for this new era. Alright, chapter two. Okay. So actually, uh, let me see. We're now in chapter two. Welcome to Castle Wolford, Minister Lila. Okay, let's go ahead and go through these cutscenes and then we'll decide from there. 
Allow me to express my gratitude to the Holy State. Were it not for your nation's generous efforts, this venture would never have come to fruition. You are too kind. Lila, let's see who this is. You too have served an invaluable role in this. All right, Lila. Lila Viscraft. She is a saintly seven minister of medicine. Uh, she is a woman of superior intellect who has appointed overseers of the Ministry of Medicine. Gotcha. Though I must admit, the news of the union between your son and Lady Frederica came as quite the surprise. None in Hyzant considered that a bannerman of Glenbrook would join with the ruling family of Esfrost. I hear that Lady Frederica is the Archduke's half-sister. I must ask... Why do they have to emphasize the half part there? Curiosity is only natural. This union was promised during the war, an arrangement made with the previous Archduke. The truth be told, I am surprised one as well informed as yourself did not already know. And this is your son, as I recall. Sarah Noah Wilford, at your service, Minister. And I am Frederica S. Frost. My son still has much to learn, but I believe this marriage will herald a bright future for us all. For today, I intend to step down and leave House Wolcourt in Sarah Noah's capable hands. You're abdicating your position? Surprising news comes in pairs, I see. Nonetheless, I am happy for you both. I imagine the lords and ladies at tonight's banquet will take great interest in the new Lord Wolfort. As will I. <laughs> Pray, go easy on the boy, my lady. I hear that young Lord Dragan of Esfrost shall also be in attendance. Indeed. He has been appointed to oversee operations at the Grand Orzalian Mines. I understand his star in Esfrost has seen a meteoric rise. Good. I would like to hear more of this new explosive substance he means to use to blast the tunnels. As a fellow ah, yes, of sorts, TNT. if in a different field, I am always curious to learn how great discoveries are made. He should have arrived by now. Has anyone seen him? Dragan's gone to see the city. He was halfway there before the gangplank landed on the docks. Ah, of course. Uh, he is your cousin, yes. I see we share an innate curiosity for new places. The banquet will begin soon. I shall seek him out and escort him there. Yeah, let's do that. Let's go ahead and find him. Tonight's festivities, I want you to act as if you're already Lord of the House. Our guests are the most esteemed personages of their respective nations. Take care not to cause offense. I'll try my best. But I won't promise anything. I do like to offend people. Or I'm a Lollafell. And offending people is my job as a Lollafell. You can't change my mind otherwise. Exploration. The flow of the game comprises multiple phases. In this phase, you are freely to move around, gather information, obtain items, me review me mechanisms, and stuff. Gotcha. Let's talk to you. And since you may have some questions regarding this joint mining venture, allow me to enlighten you. Finding the expertise and manpower. Oh, there's something shiny. This will. This mine will unearth the newly discovered vein of iron. We hope that this will prove beneficial for all parties, providing wealth, prosperity, and equal measures. It is said Lord Dragon's knowledge of ironworking is peerless. Gotcha. What's in here? Ooh, recovery pellet. What's up here? Can I enter? Oh, I can enter. Hello, I'm entering your house. I heard the Prince Roland is shirking his duties from at the castle once again. Yep, and I'm gonna see if I could steal something from your house. Don't worry, I am the, I am the, I'm your lord, so it's fine if I steal things from your house. No, okay, fine. Ooh, I, I dash quick. I got.
and what about you? By your request, Benedict and I shall take part in the tourney. Yes, we're gonna t bring victory. Shiny, that's mine. Notes. Uh, we'll find notes as we as the game progresses. These notes have no direct effect on the story, but they will help you better understand the story, the the setting. Gotcha. Greetings, my lord. My friends and I are playing hide and seek. Oh, okay. Guys, he's in here. Catch him. Anything around here that I could take? <gasps> oh, it's a cat. Okay, I have my fun. That was that I had my fun. Another quiet day. Can I enter this house? No, I can't. What kind of house is this that has no no door? The most esteemed personages from each nation will be attending the ceremony. Such an opportunity to meet and speak with your peers must not be wasted by lo my lord. My lord. Oh, I grabbed something. I didn't even know. Anything around here? Nope, nope, nope. That's it? Okay. See, this is what you gotta do. You gotta enforce your... Your, your power on people. By taking their stuff. Because this will be a communistic place. That's right. I can scarce remember the last time Glenbrook was host to a marvelous turn tourney. Who among the nations will win? Uh, me. This town is prosperous and its people have faith in, in the Lord. Ooh, I saw something shiny. The apology, the apology should be mine. I'm Serena Wolfworth. I've come to remind you to return to the castle. Of course, I appreciate the consideration. And how are you? Ah, I must make ready for the wedding ceremony. What gift would be best suit for your union? Hmm. It's impossible choice. Perhaps an audience with Lord uh, Simon will spark inspiration. There we go. Anything free here? Ooh, I took someone's money. <laughs> well, hopefully this uh, this peasant doesn't need their 300 gold. It's mine now. All right, let's see. My husband works from dawn till dusk at the port, lifting crates. Who knows what else? Let's see. Playing hide and seek uh, till dad comes home. I need to find a place to hide and quick. Uh, let's see. Take care not to hurt yourself. Your father wouldn't wouldn't want anything bad happen to you. Or ah, one of my favorite games. Burrows were always my favorite place to hide. Then it takes a clever mind to hide. Perhaps you can use the cleverness to help with your father when you're older. Mmm. That? This one's a bad. Very bad advice. Telling a little girl where to be able to hide. Imagine if someone takes... Like, they can't get out of the barrel and they get stuck in there. Someone just, like, takes that barrel somewhere else. Ooh, that's an accident waiting to happen. This is just telling them to, like, kind of grow up too quickly. Like, they don't want to care. They don't care about what they're going to do when they're older. They just care about playing hide-and-seek. So just... Let's just remind them to be careful. I will die... Uh, I will die... Got, got awful mad when I climbed up the rooftop. Awful mad. That anger comes from a place of concern. I'm not saying you shouldn't hide, but promise you'll keep your safety in mind. Good. There is no rest for a young lordling. Frederica and I shall make every effort to learn the lay of the land. Good. It's just like like him to gall gallivant off while nary a word of farewell. A farewell. Still, I suppose this is a chance to become quite acquainted with my future home. How would you describe your town, Saranoa? 
To know a town, you must take time to relish her company. That's what Eridor told me. It is a port of a certain commerce, uh, at the center of commerce, a town built on taxes, but not at the... Eh. Wolford is nested safely behind the walls. It is a town at peace and sets an example for the rest of the, town, the kingdom. I think this one's good. I haven't known Eridor for long, but those words are undeniably his. Perhaps I ought to take a page out of his book. You need to push yourself, Federica. Time is something we do not lack. Once matters have settled, I'll give you a tour of Wolford myself. I'm a zooming. I'm a zooming. Look how fast I can run. Fast as fuck, boy. Wait, is that something shiny? Nope, that was not something shiny. Did I? Huh. I guess I didn't get all of it. Well, it's a good thing I went back. <laughs> shiny. Thank you. Anything else? No? Nothing? Alright. Let me save here just in case. I don't remember if there's like a long cutscene from here. Alright, we're good. Conclude. There we go. I'm sure we'll be fine. At the banquet. Oh, is this someone new? I thank you for your hospitality to Ah yes, dragon. Drag on these nuts. Dragon S Frost. After his father Srav Svav Svav Srav Safrog was all but related to uh, was all but relegated to life on the Asfrost Outlands. He, dedica he dedicated himself to his studies at the Archives in hopes of restoring his family's honor. Ah, so our little Zuko. Think nothing of it. Did you enjoy the city, Lord Dragan? Dragon. Its people are full of or life and love for the Lord. That says all I need to know about House Wolfort. You honor us with your words. I am only being frank. Frederica is the sister of the Archduke, after all, and my cousin besides. I would not see her marry into an unworthy house. Suffice to say, my expectations were exceeded. They better be. I have heard much of your ingenious contributions to the mining efforts. I sense prosperous days are ahead of us. As do I. Finally, our nations enter into an age unfettered by war. With Esfrost's iron, Hyzant's salt, and Glenbrook's mediation, there is no limit to what we can achieve. We must regard each other as equals, and forge mutually beneficial relationships. I sense skepticism in your words, Lord Dragan. Ah, you it's Dragan. relations are not already mutually beneficial? That's how you pronounce it. It's hard for me to hear. My, my uh, speakers are low, just so it doesn't... Echo. Old words from one so young. Is that, Is that how peers speak, speak to one another? Perhaps, Perhaps the young ones, yes. yes. What do you think, Lord Serenoa? What? Dissatisfaction with the salt tax was one cause of the war, was it not? Salt is a divine boon. A gift from the goddess to her true believers. This is the foundation of the teachings that guide us in Hyzant. By allying with Esfrost, do you mean to gainsay our most fundamental beliefs? Of course not, Minister. Guys, imagine killing each other over salt. I mean, salt. yes. And we would not Having basic seasoning on your food is, like, important, but... God damn. Thank you for acknowledging would you really kill someone over salt? No, it strikes me that your words are measured. You needn't be so non-committal, Lord Zeranoa. It is only reasonable that the three of us have differing opinions on the matter. However, that is all the more reason for us to be open to frank discussion. Hmm. Honored guests, <laughs> pray forgive my son. We of House Wolfort are but simple warriors. 
I'm afraid matters of finance and politics do not come to us naturally. Exactly. This, however, we just meet heads that like to swing we will giant swords around. And tyranny wheresoever it may be. Of course, we do not enjoy conflict. Still, we will not hesitate to defend our land and our people should the need arise. No matter how mighty the threat, we will fight for home and kingdom. Yes, yes Lord Simon. Of that we are keenly aware. I apologize if I spoke out of turn. But the fact remains that as every winter passes, the tension between our nations grows, and salt is the cause. The common well then, everyone needs to stop being state. salty. I simply want to ease but, um... their suffering. The ministry I oversee is committed to the preservation of life. I personally believe that salt should not be a luxury reserved for the privileged few. All those who live require it. Not just those lucky enough to be born within oh. the borders of our holy state. <laughs> you See, this is what happens when I do a pun. I lose How someone. I feel matters little. In Highland, the word of the gods, they don't like my puns. Oh well. As to us from the lips of the Hierophant, is absolute. But perhaps this joint mining venture of yours may lead to the change you seek. Indeed, we must set our gazes to the future, all of us. I expect you will be the ones to usher us into a new era. Yes, Father. All right, so of course the first part of the game is going to be a lot of setup. There's not going to be much happening with this stream, but give it time. So I'm actually going to end it off here because again, as I said before, I want to be able to have give my brother some well-deserved rest without having to worry about me yelling off into the ether in the middle of the night. So. Uh, let me give you a quick rundown what's going to happen for next week. Uh, as I said before, we're now going to be having uh, our scheduled program of Yakuza and the Great Ace Attorney. I might add in... You know what? I am going to add in the Batman game. In honor of Kevin Conroy. If For people that uh, in the future that are watching this stream, if you are. Uh, Kevin Conroy, Kevin Conroy, the the voice of the animated Batman, passed away. Uh, in the I don't remember what time it could have been like the evening of. By this uh by this stream, November eleventh. So on yesterday, from to from this stream, he passed away. So in honor of him. And all the work he has done for the animated Batman. I'm gonna go back to playing one of the Batman games in the Arkham series. Because my god. His voice was perfect. Perfect for Batman. And I do wish him being able to finally rest. So he can rest in peace. So we're gonna bring back Batman. I think the next one we're going to be playing is Arkham City. I think that's the second one. If I'm correct, that's, that is the second one. So, with that being said, we're going to have Yakuza, Great Ace Attorney, and Batman in, in cycle. But, also, so this, this month's going to be pretty busy with a lot of games. We're uh, on release on Friday. We're going to be playing Pokemon Violet. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be streaming Pokemon Violet on Friday, of course late night because I'm gonna be working and I have to come back home from there. But it's gonna be in that cycle, and this is why I was saying that uh, these Nintendo games they might be going they might be rolling over to the evening streams. So please look forward to that. Of course, all that is gonna be on my schedule for Twitch. You're gonna see what days I'm gonna be streaming and what I will be streaming. So again, oh, oh, also, forgot, forgot, socials. Uh, follow my Twitter if you're not already have been. 
my Twitter will also show the schedule, not just from the Twitch site, but like you'll see the schedule there as well posted and pinned. And to see whatever wacky things I'm just going to be retweeting or wh whatever is on my mind. Uh, I am going to be in the process of making a Discord server. So uh, please just hold out a little bit for me so I can be able to make that. And finally, uh, follow our channel on YouTube. Subscribe to it to see Hack's side of the stuff. He, on, on YouTube, we'll see, you see more of Hack's content. It's all about comics and metal. Although right now, he has been a little bit busy. So, you'll see mostly his uploads and not enough live stream, uh, not enough streams. But again, please follow us on YouTube. With all that being said, thank you so much for watching. And this is Jack signing off. Good night, everyone.